Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Live from Total Value RV right here in Elkhart, Indiana. Shot on our brand new digital camera. What we've got here is we've got a 2020-45MX Tuscan. The MX stands for man. That's going to hit the spot, but they couldn't spell out spot, so they just put an X. Okay? So let's take a look around here. First of all, you've got, we're on the side here. You can see here where you have the slide on the 45 MX. You can see it does have a slide out topper that is covered with the awning for you. So when that slide comes out, the awning is going to come out with it in order to protect it. Here in the front compartment, see so here, this is where we have all of our hydraulics, which will operate our leveling system as well as our slides. Okay, now pull this little button right here. Yeah, okay. this, this will just pop right up here like this. And then back here, you have your bonnet, 10,000 watt generator. You can see you have your gen slide. So you just hit this button, 10,000 watt generator then, folks. This will run everything throughout the whole coach for you. You have three air conditioners on this. It will run all three for you. It will run all of your lighting and the unit. Okay, so you see the slide out there. Also see up here we have our one piece windshield. Okay, then you can shut the door there. You have your one piece windshield, so that way it's gonna give you a real nice view of this great country of ours when you're out traveling around. You have the full body paint, which you can think of that. Okay. Thing is going to, you have the dual side fill, so you can fill on either side when you're going out to fill, fill up fuel up. Here's where we have our Aqua Hot 4000. This is going to be what this does for you guys. This is your hot water heater, and this will also heat the unit, which you can either run off of the uh, diesel or you can run off of the electric either way. Okay? And here, the pass through storage. You can see it's on the raised rail chassis for Freightliner with the Atlas Foundation. And then here you have the slide out tray, which will come out this way, and it'll also come out the other way. So that way you can get your stuff in and out or. If the two of you don't be happy to be getting along, we can put a mattress in there and make that a sleeping space as well. Okay? So, come on around. Here you have some more storage. You can also see the mud flap that's in there. Okay? With our new camera, you should be able to get a good panoramic view of that full basement. Whoa! Here you have some more storage. You have the power cord reel, which is a 50 amp service, which will, that's on the power. So you just push your button, and there you have your surge guard for you as well, too. Okay. And here we have our water compartment. You can see we have the power hose reel for the uh, water. You have your whole house water filtration, sink water flush right there. You can set up what you want to do with your water heater, normal, bypass to drain. We're there to sanitize the fresh tank. And then here what you can do with your tank. If you want to fill the tank up, if you want to run off of the city water, whatever you want to do, you can do it right there. You have your outside shower. In this particular coach, you have 90 gallons of fresh water, 51 of black, and 70 of gray. Okay, then here you have your little docking lights right there for you. And back here you have the place. This is for the back of your refrigerator. And then this here is for your DEF. Okay? On the Tuscany, it's got the 450 Cummins, which has 1,250 foot-pounds of torque. Another nice thing is you have the side radiator. The advantage to that is, guys, you're not going to be catching as much as you're going to be from the back. It's all on the side, but that's nice. Now, when you have the 450 Cummins, you have a 15,000-pound hitch in the back with your seven-way plug, which is integrated right into the rear cap here for you. And also, on your roof, guys, you also have a, t a fiberglass roof. And right there you have your backup camera and then your two docking lights. So when you're backing up, you can see what's going on around. It's a beautiful weather day. Here we have our batteries right here. Here's where you have, you have the solar charger on this as well too. So right there's where your solar is. You can see it's charging it slowly, trickle charging at 12.8. There's your DEF if you want to do the manual for the DEF. Okay, so you can do your DEF on either side. Here when you have the tag axle in too as well, on this one here, for the tires, what you have here is, hold on there, you have the 295 ADR 22.5 inch tires for the back two, and then you have the 305s in the front. Another nice thing on the Tuscany is it's independent front suspension, okay? So that way you can turn it, get a 60 degree wheel cut, almost turn it to itself. Here's where you have your fresh water tank where you can do your gravity fill. 
Here's the other side of the storage. You can see you have quite a bit of storage in this coach. Okay? So when you get out there, go to see this great country of ours, go ahead. Go ahead and gather up some stuff and put it in the coach. Or just take it in there if you want to get away. Say, for example, get away from this stuff. Okay? You can get in this, fire it up, and head to a place that's got nothing but sunshine. And none of the snow. And you don't have to wear a jacket. Okay? There's some more storage. Okay? Now also here we have our outside TV. So you get done with the day going out and seeing the sights, whatever it may be. You want to come back home, sit out in front of the campfire. You can do it right here. You have your sound bar right there for you. You can also see here's where we have our patio awning. Our patio awning comes out with the slide, and then it'll come out and cover this area for you, okay? And it is a power awning. Okay. We showed you this. This is some more storage. And you, I said 305, it's 315s, I apologize, 315 ADR 22 and a half inch tires in the front. The other side here, Phil, one thing I didn't point out on the other mirror with your chrome mirrors, you can see right here you have your side cameras. So when you turn on your turn signal, it's going to come down and show you down which other side of the coach you would like. So would you like to see the inside? What's your cameraman would. See the nice heavy duty step that comes out there, you have two steps. Right now we're kind of aired up for you. Okay, yes. Hi, how are you, sir? This is another random fan walking by. Okay. So you can see this here. We've got it kind of aired up here. When you don't have it aired up, then this will sit a little bit lower, and then your step will sit lower for you as well. Okay. So, come on in. So right when we first come in, we've already turned it on, but here you got your house battery. Turn on for your step light right there, your entry light. This is for the step cover, so this will come out and make this area flat. When you're sitting there, turn on your kitchen ceiling lights, your awning lights, and then your master lights on and off. We're going to go ahead and flip them on. So when we come in here, we can see. Okay, come on in. Now let's take a look at this is what the 45MX looks like with the slides in. Okay, so you can see we can still get to everything that we need to get to. And get back to the kitchen, get back to my cooking area, the refrigerator. And I can get to this half bath up front here for us. Okay? So now what we're going to do, one thing that they have done for 2020, in order to help with any slide issues that might have happened, what we have to do is we start the coach, and then we'll put the slides out. Okay, now in order to start this, all you do, guys, is you come here, you put your foot on the brake, and then you'll see right here it say engine, start, and stop. Just hold that down. Now my coach is started. Look at the nice view that they give you right here. This is your backup monitor. You've got your navigation that's in here. It's also your stereo. Look how easy that is to view. Also, I really love what they've done with the 2020 dash here. Very well, easy to read and everything there for you. Okay, and you control what you want right here. There's a little voltage that tells us our trips and everything of that nature. Okay, this particular one too, when you're out looking, you're out shopping around for that 45MX, you might want to say, Hey, Mr. Salesperson, where's that one with 79.7 .7 miles? From what I hear from out in the field, is a lot of people can say that the salesman just kind of looks at it like a deer in headlights. Kind of just, what? What they have to answer to you is it's a total value RV. It's a total value RV exclusive. Come here under 100 miles. Why is that important? You're the very first person to put the first critical miles on this coach. Not somebody who gets paid to get from here where they're built to wherever they're taking Okay, so now we're going to go back here to the command center. Okay, and it'll tell you each one to say retract or extend. It'll tell you the slide. So here we're going to do the passenger side. One thing I want to point out, do you hear anything when that slide's going out? Very little. It's the advantage of the hydraulic slides. Work. Much smoother, easier in and out. So you can see just by that little bit of room there, how much more room we have just by putting this side out. Okay? Now we're going to do the driver's side. This is the whole wall slide. The 2020 Tuscany's have done a lot of nice things with the nice lighting they have up here on the road for you. Also your quiet pool. You don't have to turn up the TV, you've got your air conditioning on, 
which you can see if you look here in the center, it says we're putting the slide that will kind of go over there. See these right here? What it's going to do is it'll circulate the air, come in, take it in here, and then dumps it along the center. So even when your slides are in, you're still taking advantage of the air conditioning. Okay, so now we've got all the slides out. You can see how much more room we've got here. We're at our destination. It's time to see everything. Okay, Mr. Cameraman, what we'll do, we'll have you sit in the seat there. We kind of went over some of the stuff, but we'll just go over it a little bit more. Okay, now you're in the driver's seat. Look at that beautiful view. Your one-piece windshield there that you have. You have a power shade there in the front, which will come down. You have a night shade and a uh, day shade. You can see right here, here's where you have the tag dump. We can dump the air, turn your dash fans on, you want to turn the air horn on to let people know you're around. You got your cab light, your service light, your dock light, turn your mirror heat on, and then you also have the auxiliary start, which what that'll do is that'll take your house batteries and your coach batteries and combine them together so that way you can still start your coach. Here you can see we have the automatic leveling system where you just hit auto and it'll automatically go down and level from front to back to side to side for you. Okay? Then there you have your mirror control, the power mirror control little cup holder right there, turn your lights on, the new dash for 2020 on the Freightliner, okay, and right here's where we can start our generator, here's where we can do the sunshade, okay, and then you can do the nightshade, so you got your day and night, here's where you can lock and unlock the cargo compartments right from here, and then you have your little map light right there, okay, and there you had your monitoring system there, okay, both of these seats, the passenger seat does have a recliner on it, so you can turn this around, or when you're going down the road, you just want to maybe lean back and relax a little bit, put your recliner out, you can do it right there, okay? Both the driver and the passenger seat will turn around and make part of the living area for us, okay? So, now we're going to come out here in the front. Over here, you have your couch right here. This is the couch and the dinette combo that they put in the 45MX. And you can see where your TV pops up right here for you, okay? This will make into a bed. You have two seat belts there. And you do have two seat belts back here as well. And then over here on this side, you have the theater seating, which you have seat belts there. So you can seat belt one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight folks in this. Okay? So right here then, we have some storage right here. New wood. I think it's a real sharp look for you. Okay? The theater seats then have the recliners on them as well too. And then you do have a little space right here that you can store some stuff, which is pretty spacious really and then the two cup holders, okay? Up here in the front then, another nice thing we've done, say you want to sleep some more people, they put in this new Euro loft. As you can see, if you've looked at any of the older, you used to be able to see the belts and everything. Now you can't see them until it comes down. But here you've got another place for someone to sleep. You've got their own little TV, storage compartment there, storage compartment there, storage compartment there, and another storage compartment there. And then when you're not using it, just take it, put it back up, and it's out of the way. You don't have to tell anybody you have the extra sleeping if you don't want to. Okay? This can just be storage or just some contraption that we're not real sure what it does. Okay? So, we went over the areas there. Now we're in the kitchen. Okay? So here in the kitchen area, we have solid surface countertops like we've always had. But here, you have to pull out drawers. Right here, look at all the extra countertop space you get with that. And then look at the drawers here, how nice and deep they are. Look at all your remotes. Some more storage there. Some more storage there. Okay. Come on around. Here you have some more storage. This is another nice thing here too as well. You do have the Wi-Fi available, the WineGuard 2.0 4G LTE router, router and Wi-Fi extender. Okay, which you can buy a subscription to this. Um, I'd have to look at the price for it is what it is for the year, but that way. Oh, here it is. 12 months of unlimited data for $360. So you can just use it as just like your uh, Wi-Fi, whatever it is. You get that right through to go. Some more storage there. Some more storage here. This is a nice thing if you do purchase a Thor diesel. They have the Thor Diesel Club, which you have a nice little rally every year. Everybody gets together. It's a good way for like-minded people to get together and tell about their great adventures that they've had out there. Something new for 2020. Look at the nice big armor set that you have here. Okay with your solid surface countertops, okay? This here is a pull-up with some plug-ins for you, okay? Two more plug-ins. High-rise residential faucet with the pull-out sprayer, right there. 
Here you have some more storage. Maybe you can compartmentalize that for you as well. Okay, we come here. We've got our induction cooktop right here. Okay, so you can do your cooking right there. Then up here you have your convection microwave oven, which is will bake for you. Do everything that an oven does, it's just done by convection. So it's about half the time from what I understand. Okay. Then here we had our farmer's sink, which we like to call the manual dishwasher. And then also on the Tuscany, it comes with the automatic dishwasher. Okay? So you can do it either way. And then you got some more storage right there. Okay? And then over here above the dinette. What I like to say about this, look at where this dinette is, guys. What side of the coach are we on? Patio side. Okay? So here when you're eating, you're looking at your patio, not your neighbor's patio. So we can keep see what's going on in your patio. Plus, if your neighbors are cooking something better, you'll never know. Here you have some more deep storage for you as well. This is the solar that I was telling you about here. It's already on board. High efficient solar panel with a 25 year warranty. Tested for one inch hailstones at 51 miles per hour, which is pretty impressive. Then, right there, you have your fireplace. Okay. Then you also have your mirror right here. Here, if you're going out on the road, going to be taking a lot of stuff. The Tuscany is designed for some extended stays, so we give you the residential refrigerator with the ice maker, plenty of places to put your food in there, a nice big pull-out freezer right here, and then right next to the refrigerator, we have our pantry, there's a nice slide-out tray there, and then another one in here. Okay. So in the 45MX, this is a bath and a half unit. Now here, this is what we were showing you. See here, this is where we did the slides. You can go to the home right here. Turn your master lights on. You can do your TV lift up and down right here. Okay. Have it go up and down right there. Then here, this is where you can set your temperatures for what your. This is the exterior. This is for your temperatures. You got the front air conditioner, the mid air conditioner, and then the rear. This will tell you your voltage right here. So do your water pump, turn on the aqua hot on the diesel or on the electric. And this will tell you your levels of your fresh, your gray, and your black. And here's where I can set for the generator here. Okay, it's already got the transfer switch. We can do the generator, set it up on the um, auto generator start. So if you're going, you're not plugged in or whatever it may be, you want to set it for the voltage, you can do it right there for you. Okay, and here you have your black heater right here. And then here, again, we'll tell you for your batteries. And this is where you can turn on your inverter here and then if you want to charge the coach as well okay and we have the lights for all the different areas there's where you set your temperatures for each area here this is so you control your fans you got a fan in the kitchen you got a fan in the mid bath a rear bath fan and then a bedroom fan you can do it all right there and there's the slides that we told you about and then back here is just the general setting you can set it up for the mobile app and everything of that nature Remember earlier we showed you when the, the uh, slides were in this is your half bath back here Okay, so you got the porcelain stool, you have the macerator on there for you as well too. You have a sink right here. I love this saying right here, smell that. Of course you don't. It's because it has the uh, special valve in it there. Okay, here's your medicine cabinet for this one here. So here's your fan that we were telling you about. Then you also have your window right here. Remember with the frameless dual pane windows, they open out this way. So that way you can still get a nice airflow even if you don't have uh, your air conditioner on. Okay, and you do have the central vac and the Tuscany for you as well. So now we're coming into the bedroom area. Okay, if you're out camping, you might get your clothes a little bit dirty, so it comes with the stackable washer and dryer right from Whirlpool. Okay, here you have your bedroom TV, which also has some storage back behind it. And then back here is where you have some more storage there, and storage up top. Here you have it where you can do some hanging space right there. And then three little drawers right here. Drawers there. Some bigger drawers right here. Okay. And then even under the bed, there's more there. And some more here. Okay. And then you have four doors and drawers up here. You have nightstands on either side, which you can have your plug in. And then you have a little storage right there. You can see how that storage is. King size bed, which is the tilt bed. 
So if you want to watch a little bit of the movie or whatever it may be at the end of the day, tilt your bed up, and you can watch your TV right there. You have your ceiling fan. You also have a window right there. Excuse me. You do have plug-ins on either side of the coach, uh, either side of the bed, so that way you can plug them in. Now look at this bathroom. This bathroom is huge. I think it's beautiful. You got two sinks right here, so no more arguing about who's going to be able to get ready. We can go ahead and get ready at the same time. Okay? And then you have storage there. You have some storage here. Some storage there. Some storage there. Wow. Some more here. Let's put some round towels or whatever we need. Right there. Excuse. There. Spot there. Another place for your sponges, whatever it may be. Some more storage there. Look at this beautiful shower with this glass door and the ceramic tile that we've got going around it then too. Okay? And look at this shower head. This is gonna be just like it's raining. I don't know if Mr. Cameron you can see that, but it's gonna give you you got two shower heads right there, so you're gonna get plenty of water, place to keep all your soaps and uh, shampoos and everything of that nature. You have your toilet back here, which you do have the macerator on that. Some more storage there. Here's your back fan. Okay. And look at this. Cedar lined. You can get a lot of stuff in there. Okay. All cedar lined. So, let's just look at this right here. Look at this. Just in the bathroom. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, and 17 for Johnny. Right there. Doors and doors in just the bath area. But look how massive this is. This is part of the slide out right here, guys, too, as well. So this sink is sliding out. Okay? So there's our little walk around on our 2020 45 MX. Man, that's going to hit the spot. Just couldn't fit spots. So we put the X. Okay? Might say, hey, how can you get a hold of us? Well, we have a phone. Call us at 866-282-4460, or you can visit us on the web at TotalValueRV.com, or you can go to our YouTube channel where we put up all of our videos. If you guys see something that we missed or something you'd like for us to go back over, please comment and let us know. Or if there's a motorhome you'd like to see us do a walk around on, we'll be more than happy to do that. Okay? So nice thing is, guys, you got to remember this. This is where you come in as strangers and you leave as friends. Okay? And if you're still here, thanks for watching.